Broccoli is one of the best winter vegetables to grow in the winter greenhouse. You know, broccoli does really well in the cool winter growing months. So there's one variety of broccoli that is better in the winter greenhouse than others. And I'm going to share with you that variety that I grow and four secrets to getting them through the coldest nights. Hello, my name is Lynn Gillespie, creator of the High Performance Greenhouse eCourse and Greenhouse Advisor for the Grow Network. And I've been growing broccoli in my five greenhouses in the Rocky Mountains for years. And we harvest broccoli from April through December from these greenhouses. Now, growing broccoli in your greenhouse, it's easy if you know what variety to grow and a few garden skills to get your broccoli through the coldest nights. So let's get started with the varieties to grow. So there's two main types of broccoli that we can grow. The first is a standard head broccoli and the other is a mini broccoli. So we used to grow just the standard head broccoli in the farm. We would plant it in the spring, harvest the main head in the summer and get small bites of heads into the late fall. And then one season I tried growing a mini broccoli and it made tons of small heads on long stalks that are similar to asparagus stalks. And the plants just kept producing almost a half a pound per broccoli plant every week, all season long. And we ate a lot of broccoli and so did our CSA members. I decided to try the mini broccoli in the greenhouses and we started harvesting the broccoli in April and continued to harvest the mini heads right up until January and that's nine full months of harvest. Then we pulled out the plants, replanted another crop in February, and then started to produce broccoli heads again in April. And our harvest window for this, the uh, mini broccoli was from April all, all the way until January. So I was really impressed with the production of the mini broccoli, and I was so impressed that we just stopped planting the standard broccoli altogether. So the two varieties of mini broccoli that I like are Burgundy and BC1611. Now as a bonus, we also eat the leaves of the broccoli plants just like we eat kale and spinach. This way you get two crops in one. Now getting the right variety is the first step to winter broccoli success in our greenhouse. But we get a few nights that are just too cold and can damage the broccoli heads. So we developed a system to protect the broccoli when the nights got too cold. So here are my four secrets to keeping the mini broccoli thriving through the coldest nights without heating the greenhouse. All right, number one, plant the mini broccoli in the greenhouse in the spring and be prepared to keep it going all summer long. These mature plants will be the plants that we take into the fall and the winter. So they keep producing as long as the plant is alive and I have grown mini broccoli in temperatures up to 106 degrees Fahrenheit this allows me to grow all spring and summer and have the mature plants in the fall. So if your location is just too hot and you can't keep them alive through the summer, then start a fresh crop in late August or early September. Okay, number two is keep them on the dry side. When a plant is waterlogged, its natural antifreeze system is diluted and the plant has a better chance of frost damage if the plant is too wet. My watering philosophy in the winter is only water when absolutely necessary and you're going to be surprised as to how long a mature mini broccoli plant can go without water. Sometimes it's three to four weeks between watering for my plants. All right, number three is low tunnels and cold frames. So I will make a low tunnel or a cold frame inside my greenhouse over each bed or I can throw the frost blankets over the broccoli plants because they are strong enough to hold up to the covers without frames. And I want to cover the plants at night if the temperature is going to dip below 20 degrees Fahrenheit. And this is the temperature that the broccoli heads can start to get some frost damage. So before we get to the last secret to keeping the mini broccoli thriving through the winter, I want to invite you to enroll in a high performance greenhouse e-course. So in this course, we teach you what type and size of greenhouse you need, how to plant it for the most food production, how to figure out the timing and the spacing for each plant and what plant varieties to grow and so much more. So if you want to learn more about the e-course and get the special coupon code for our YouTube viewers, you can find this in the description below the video. All right, number four is insulative covers. So over the low tunnels or the broccoli plants, I add one layer of 1.5 ounce insulative cover for each 10 degrees drop in temperature below freezing. For example, if it's predicted to go to 22, I will put on one layer. If it's predicted to go to 12, I will put on a second 1.5 ounce frost blanket layer. 
So two layers is maximum for protection and be sure to remove the cover during the day so the plant gets light and the air in the soil can warm up. 